the number five overtime finish of all time, the 2014 NFC Championship. There was nothing about that game that made any sense. It's as improbable of win as I've ever witnessed. I had to change my lead five times between halfway through the fourth quarter and the end of the game. It's one of those rare games in which you can say, yeah, it was an incredible comeback. At the same time, it was a horrific loss for Green Bay. Even with a Super Bowl berth on the line, our number five game did not seem destined for overtime greatness. Russell Wilson was easily the worst he's been in any one half of football as a professional. Here's one pass into the air, and the rookie Clinton Dix on the return. Their quarterback had a zero rating at the end of the first half. Wilson's already tied his career high now with three interceptions just in this first half. After pick number four, a Super Bowl berth appeared all but certain for the Packers. Intercepted by Morgan Burnett with 5-0-4 to go in the game. Five minutes to go, you pick off Russell Wilson, it's over. Curse after that ball gets picked off. They knew it. It was over. They were about to pull off the impossible, beat the Seahawks in Seattle in January. Ball's picked off with five minutes left. Julius Peppers tells the guy, Lay down, lay down, take it easy. Yeah, tell me, go down. The entire team should have been like, get up, get up. There's a chance we may crap the bed in the most cosmic and unpredictable of fashions. Hey, we can still win this game. Stay in it, man. The game makes our top five because of what happened in the final five minutes of regulation. Here come the Seahawks. Onside kick coming up. There it is. Bounces high. Seattle has a chance. The Seahawks got it. The Seahawks have it in midfield. Everything was falling apart at that point because they were just letting the Seahawks come back. Here's Lynch. Lynch! Marshawn Lynch! Baseball! Can you say come back? We will go to overtime. Once the Seahawks won the coin toss before overtime, it is heads. Seattle wins the toss. The Packers should have just packed it in. They should have just shook hands and said, thanks for having us. We're taking a flight back to Wisconsin. There's no chance we can win this game. First and 10 at the Green Bay 35. Drops back. He's going to throw down the middle. He's got a man. Come on. Come on. Game over. Game over. Touchdown. The game is over. The Seahawks are going back to the Super Bowl. If you think about what Seattle actually had to do in that game, score two touchdowns in less than five minutes. Are you kidding? They had to let an onside kick be recovered by the opposition because of a mental error. Brandon Boston got to make that catch. Have Russell Wilson throw a cross-field 45-yard pass to get a two-point conversion. Oh, my word! Win the coin toss and throw a 40-yard post route touchdown in overtime. When the game was on the line and you had to start making some plays, Russell Wilson, Marshawn Lynch, they made them. When you have the game in your grasp, and all you have to do is make any one of about 10 different plays to make the game be over, you have to find a way to, to end it right there.